Hey guys, this is Giovanni from the Options Trading Channel. Today is May 16, 2019, and I finally had an opportunity to actually sit at my computer and watch the markets today. Even though the markets are not slow, I didn't get a signal today, mainly because of the, the way it's trading. Um, that's what I'm telling myself anyways, as far as the indicators that I use, they just weren't lining up correctly. I figured I would tell you guys and show you guys the three trades that I made off camera while I was working my day job. Unfortunately, I had to work um, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday of this week, and I wasn't able to actually record any of my trades. But I did show you one, and I would I was thinking it's very unfair that you guys didn't see the other trades that I took. And let's start with Apple. Apple was uh, one that I, I took. Um, you can see here, of course, this is my, my account here. It's live, it's not just a screenshot. You can see uh, the bid and ask of SPY is actually moving. And these are my trades. These are my trades here. You can see here on the 13th of this, uh, of this month, um, I took a position. I only bought one put option. Uh, of the 185 puts on Apple, I bought them at 8.06 my time and I wanted to show you my signal here. We're looking at the five minute chart on Apple for May 13th when I took that trade and I traded it because I got this signal right here. Um, as you can see this down arrow per my algorithm, I didn't get in until the a minute after the open of this candle, which in hindsight, I was really late. I really was. I was really late. And I barely caught that tiny little move there. And I sold for a $5 profit after commission fees. I think I only made like three bucks, four bucks, whatever. Now uh, you can see here, I bought it at 350 and I sold it at 355 how um, three minutes later that's it three minutes later i just didn't like the way that the options were moving and not to mention the um the spreads the spread on the bid and ask on apple are a lot more a lot and a lot different than something than uh, the the cues and spy the other trade that i took i think i showed you i believe this one mm -hmm, i bought at 188 bought two of them sold the first one at 193 and sold the other one at 207 i actually have a video of that not ne not necessarily the actual move but i did make a video of that while i was at my day job that was my uh latest video the other trade that i took was yesterday i didn't record it or anything and here i am mentioning it um i bought spy calls i bought two of them of the 284.50 calls and I ended up selling the first one for a gain at $1.94, six cent gain. And the other one I held and I sold for a loss essentially, but um, I basically broke 100% even ex um, other than commission fees. I sold the first one for a six cent gain and then the second one I actually sold for a six cent loss. So that, that basically negates any and all money profit losses there and i only lost commission fees let me show you um something as to why i actually traded it you're you're not i didn't get a signal but i still wanted to show you here this was yesterday on spy and this is the cool thing about my strategy um let's see here i bought in at 9 28 my time and you can see right here, you'll see the time. The top left hand corner, you can see the time. So I bought in at 9.28 my time. So uh, while this candle was, was still working, I thought that I was gonna get a signal here um, at this candle, at the close of this candle. And I bought, and when it closed, I didn't get that signal and I didn't even get that signal on this um, candle. So it spooked me out. I ended up selling, you know, whatever um, I could. And I saw that I was a profit. And I was like, well, I'll hold on to the next one. And the very next candle, it was red. It just spooked me out. I rather just, um, you know, cut loose, um, you know, cover, you know, cover my butt essentially. Uh, but my strategy is better than me. 
I have to have more confidence in my strategy and I have to t constantly tell myself that my strategy is better than me. I just thought I had to show you guys those trades. Uh, I would be doing a disservice to you guys had I not showed them to you. Whether I win, lose, break even, whatever the case may be. Honesty is sort of my, my theme here on my channel. Showing you all my trades, showing you my strategy. Um, and not just, I'm not, I'm not just here for the views or just here to, you know, give you bogus information like so many other channels out there that the, all they want to do is make a quick buck. They want to sell you a course. They want to sell you bogus information. Uh, they want you in your, in their chat rooms and just doing technical analysis, you know, videos that anybody, anybody can, can go out there and, you know, just fake a trend line, uh, pick two points on any chart, and they cherry pick the hell out of these charts. I wanna do something completely different. I wanna show you guys the real deal, a real strategy, something that I built that I believe in. I'm showing you guys, not necessarily live, but I'm actually you know putting myself out there, putting my trades out there, and that is the whole idea, guys. Hopefully, you can learn something from my trading and I've already learned from a lot of you guys. A lot of you guys, you know, um, comment below and uh, and email me and send me information and, and I appreciate that. It, it's so cool. I'm building sort of a trading community here within my YouTube channel. I love that. Comment down below what you think makes a great trader. Is it by, you know, the amount of money that they trade per trade um, the amount of money that they have in their trading account whether it's the percentage gain that they make in each trade um, what creates in your mind what makes a great trader a great trader comment down below i want to see your comments i want to see your your answers um, and let's share ideas guys if you haven't already hit that subscribe button down below like and share my videos and don't forget to hit that bell notification so you get notified the moment that i upload a video thank you so much guys and i'll see you here next time on the next trade